Hello guys, today what we're going to do is uh, we're going to do some uh, bread rolls. In order to do the bread rolls, we're going to use uh, one egg, one package of yeast, that is uh, 7 grams of yeast, and 500 grams of uh, flour. This make sure I'm going to mix it together with the uh, warm water, and I'm going to mix it for around 7 minutes. Now that I'm finished with the mixing, the mixture, I'm going to leave it uh, to grow. It's going to grow something like uh, the double of the size. And I'm going to leave it for uh, around one hour, one hour and a half, it depends the warm of the, of the room that you're working on. And you need to see if it grows or it didn't grow. In order to grow, I leave in the towel over that and I leave it to grow. As you can see, it already grow, and I'm going to put it on the table. In order to work on the table, I'm uh, putting some uh, flour on the table and I'm also uh, putting the dough on the flour so it cannot stick on the table. That is something very important for that because if you are not going to put the flour on the table, the dough is going to uh, to stick on the table. And when you are putting the dough on the table, you also need to uh, to make a little massage to the to the dough and work the dough a little bit more. As you can see that I'm doing that. And after that, what I'm going to do, I'm going to flat it. And when I'm flattening it, after that, I'm going from the from the dough, I'm going to do uh, some uh, balls. And from those balls, you are going to see that I'm uh, making uh, the bread. As you can see now, I'm flattening everything. And you also can see that every time that I'm flattening, I'm also uh, putting uh, some uh, flour on the surface where I'm doing that, uh, or trying to use the flour that is already on the surface so the dough cannot stick on the table. So today I'm going to use two methods. One method is with a cup, and the other method, the other method, is going to be with the triangle. So you're going to see in a little while. I'm going to use that method, and as always, I'm putting flour where I'm working, and don't forget to put flour. If you're not putting flour, it's going to stick. That's from experience. So the cup is going to measure how large it's going to be. Uh, it's something like the diameter is something like 30 centimeters and uh, no greater than that. As you can see, I'm uh, with that. I'm actually doing uh, two holes with the cup. You are going to see also in a, in a, in a second that I'm doing a two holes, as you can see now. And from the two holes, I'm going to take the dough. And also from the surrounding of the hole, from the two holes, I'm going to make to take the the dough and make a, the balls with it. And now you're going to see that I'm making the balls. Now, as you can see, I'm using the second method. The second method is uh, to make a triangle, and from the triangle, I'm making the ball. Now, with the balls, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put it on the pan, and I'm going to leave them uh, also to uh, to grow a little bit because uh, the yeast are going to work 
and still and uh, we are and they are going to uh, grow a little bit we are i mean leaving that for around uh, 30 minutes you know just 30 minutes it's going to grow a little bit also i'm putting a little bit of oil on the pan and with the masking i'm also uh, distributing the oil on the pan and putting the the balls on the pan the oil is only so they are not going to stick on the pan when I putting them uh, on the in the oven and and letting them a little bit to uh, grow the them for another 20 minutes. After that, you're going to see that I'm going to put them uh, in the oven and they are going to be in around 180 degrees Celsius. It's something like 356 uh, Fahrenheit in around 20 minutes. After the 20 minutes, they're going to be uh, finished. And now you are seeing, you are seeing the the end result of that. They actually uh, bread. As you can see, they are a little bit of crispy, and they are going to be tasty. So thank you all to, for watching this video, if you like this video please like the video, if you dislike the video please. Thank you all for watching, if you like this video like this video, if you dislike the video dislike the video, don't forget to subscribe and thank you everybody and happy holidays.